so good. This is a grand At finals home. match, to be honest. Yeah, <laughs> honestly. So here we go. We're going to see Sharp starting off with the Zero Suit Samus. Going to try and continue that um, little roll they had at the end of Winter Semis. See if they can keep that momentum going here. Uh, they've had a nice little time to rest. I'm sure they were keeping their hands loose, but Ned is on a bit of a roll. But it does not matter, says Sharp, because I'm here to play. Oh, my God. Oh, oh man. These rolls are... Oh, man. He's oh my this man god from losers. what kind of that zero to death was insane that and like was... <laughs> the all of those like it's, it's not like he got that from just a really good combo or whatever it was just all really good reads that was beautiful <laughs> i was yeah. gonna say man it looks like it looks like sharp wasn't even in the warming bench man he has been active all night long oh my yeah i kind of <laughs> expected this too um sharp not even going with the Joker to start things off. Just, I mean, you, right, you the guys, zero suit worked really well. I'm just gonna yeah. start off the gate with zero suit. Oh my god! You guys man. said it yourselves, man. This does not look like a losers finals match. This is more of a grand finals match in losers finals. Yeah, but Ned is definitely not ready for the type of player that Sharp is right now because Sharp is killing it. I'm sure we'll see Ned kind of, kind of adjust to the pace of the tempo. But man, Sharp bothering him does does he even have time you can see the aggression in sharp man if you want to stay charizard always remember you're a big hurt box sharp is sitting here like man it's 130 i'm tired i want to end this tournament yeah <laughs> he is he is definitely uh in a rush right now <laughs> all right we're gonna see what ned can get going here only 105 so far on sharp but sharp is continuing just to be an absolute menace here building up more damage that is that gonna be it that's not gonna be it no way okay <laughs> Ooh, disgusting. he said he he literally i told you he read you he heard you man he's probably listening to the stream and he said don't worry skiff it is it it is it <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I'm not trying to have any bias because I'm a mod in his chat or anything, but Sharp's sick. <laughs> Sharp is so sick. Yeah. No, Sharp's definitely one of the most impressive players with a most multitude of characters. But, man, 3 socking Ned is That's no easy not feat. something a lot of people can do. Agreed. Agreed. Even in spite of that, though, I feel like Ned's really going to make this set very competitive. Oh, yeah, no, I, I think, I mean, game one looked awful. Like, we, we can all agree on that. That was a rough ending, too. But Ned has definitely shown, hey, I'll get my tempo. I'll, I'll find my game. And uh, I wouldn't be surprised if we see a much more competitive game right into game two. Bring it right back to Smashville. He knows he can win here. All right. Well, good opening right now. Going to get that up smash. Right now, it's okay. There we go. We're not gonna have another zero to death. We got that out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's a good, actually, a good opening from Ned, though. Getting a good 42%. Trying to stay elusive here, but Sharp gonna be able to find that side beat. Oh, getting a couple up airs. Beautiful stuff. I thought he was gonna go for the ZSS Smash 4 combo there. Uh, that was a little scary. Oh, he doesn't even need. Oh, yeah, man, you said it. Like Ned, Ned looking for momentum in a game where Sharp controls the entire pace in terms of speed and pressure, but Sharp is not letting go of anything at this opportunity. You could even see it in his movement too. He knows. Okay, you want to jump out of shield after my Nair? That is your mistake there, because I can react as soon as possible. How good Dude, Nair is. Sharp is just on another level. He actually, he took that 42% from Squirtle and then didn't get touched for the rest of that stack. Oh, uh, really great. Oh, yep. worth, smart worth, stuff. Worth, Super worth. smart stuff. Absolutely worth. Sharp on a whole other level. Asana, yo, Sharp. Asana, yo. Man, he even got already... He's even got strides quiet. He's like, hold on, man. I can't even catch up to this. Honestly... <laughs> Honestly, man, Sharp is not slowing down whatsoever. Like, that first stock from the first game is like, it's just been filling the gas ever since then. And Ned's just been struggling to keep up, which is very surprising to me. Gotta say. But I, I don't know. I don't know what it is. I wonder <laughs> if this is just, like, not a 
I think Sharp's angry around. from from winners. I, I honestly, I think that's just what it is. Uh, it was a, it was a game five oh. set. I know Sharp didn't want to drop that, and now he's got to go through Ned to get back to uh, Ashton, and I'm sure he's ready to get there. Yeah, this is not gonna be easy for Ned whatsoever. I, oh, yeah. I I see what he's doing here with the Charizard. He wants to just you know get this stock and cash out on the rage for the last stock. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. That's fine, you know, sometimes you're gonna miss that, but you get to get it out of the way. The up smash is gonna clear out that stock. You're gonna get that taunt in there saying, hey man, I'm here to play. You are not gonna run over me or disrespect me like that. See, yep, jump out of there. But the boost kick out of the parry. Oh my goodness, big oh, Charizard he's doesn't not done. matter. He's Goes not done. so deep off he's... the stage to close that out. Sharp, he's, he's on fire, man. I don't know what else I can say. He's trying to tell this man the bra the res bracket is ready at 12 o'clock. I'll see you there, my friend. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> Jeez. Like, it's kind of crazy, too, because when you think about how much momentum Ned had coming into this set, you just wouldn't expect uh, Sharp to just be shutting it down so hard right now, but uh, it's what it is. Yeah, so far, I mean, I'm gonna be real with you guys. I've only been recording this match for the past four minutes. <laughs> so, that says a lot. Yeah, man. Uh, I got nothing to really, really add to this gameplay right now, man. Sharp, Sharp's gameplay is really just telling it all at the moment. I, I'd love to hope that, like, we can see Ned find some sort of way to come back here, but... It is definitely looking rough. They did, that game two definitely was more competitive, but even then, it, it still felt like Sharp was in control the entire time. The reason why he went down that first stock was because he went for that suicide down air. And yeah, man, it's it's a tough one to deal with. Yeah. All right, well, here's a different character here coming out from that. It's gonna be- Never Greninja. seen that play this character ever in my life. Never. If you have anybody who, who watches Ned on stream, yo, man, please let us know if he's ever practiced this character. I mean, hey, you know what? Sometimes when you're uh, you're just in uh, that desperation mode, sometimes you gotta try some crazy things. Yeah, uh, I mean, it's Ned. It's Ned. He's a PGR player, one of the best in the world. I have faith that he ha at least has an idea of what he's doing. Maybe this works out. Well, I think Greninja actually isn't bad versus his character whatsoever, to be honest. <laughs> he has the speed to keep up with Zero Suit. You have great tools to punish Zero Suit's landing, like from her yeah. jumps in dash attack. You have a decent projectile as well. And, uh, and if you're good with the kill confirms, you, you can kill pretty early. So, you know, uh, it makes sense to pick, like, pick Greninja. Mm -hmm. It's just, I'm just wondering how good Ned's Greninja is, you know? That is exactly right, right. that. Wait, once you take that into consideration, that is the bigger question. You're right, Strax. How good is this Greninja up against Sharp's ZSS that's put Ned in such a back foot? To the point that, like, Ned is, like you said, right? He's in a desperation mode. He's digging deep in these pockets to bring out some kind of W. Even if it means a character that it, like strides or I myself have not even seen. Yeah, I mean the worst case scenario is again, yeah, Greninja is a great character. I, I feel like Ugh, that's tough to deal with. Gonna have to bite that bullet. But again, Greninja is a great character. Actually, does really well against a lot of like top tiers. For instance, uh, I think beats or goes. Uh, I think beats Lucina is what a lot of Lucina mains say. Yeah, I've heard that opinion thrown out there a few times. And that's that's saying that's saying something. If you can beat Lucina, you got to be a, a pretty solid character. But again, um. Yeah, like we definitely saw uh, Ned have a really good fighting, uh, not a fighting chance, but it definitely it was really it felt like it felt really competitive in that first stock there. But it just seems like it was mostly Sharp just adjusting to the new temple, the new pace, and maybe Sharp has already figured out what's going on here. And we'll see, we'll see if Ned's able to take that stock. Yeah, right here, Ned uh, can't really get the down tilt up smash. To work. He couldn't even get down so tilt forward there. Yeah, he's just he's really trying to get these kill confirms to get the easier stocks. But there's the forwarder. Like yeah, at that point it looked like he has to just rely on like a rock kill or maybe an edge guard. But uh finally getting that stock here. Let's see what he can do at low percent. The ninja doesn't have any problem racking up the percent. Oh but the oh, down smash was... was perfect spot and then just drift off a B. That was actually really, really smart. Um, that, that was actually really insane. Yeah, I think I think Sharp might just really have this one 
all together, man. He is feeling it. He is in a mood right now, it looks like. Ooh. Oh, beautiful flip kick, though. Dude, he's... That is so lucky that wasn't the spike. Yeah, we'll have to see if Ned can find some sort of way. He's got to dig so deep to find some sort of way to come back here. I thought that Sharp was going to go for the down air again, but, I mean, definitely smart not to go for that special Greninja who's so mobile in the air. Okay. His Mather flip kick. Oh. Oh. The yeah. Oh, no. The end lag from counter. I'm sorry, from substitute. It's pretty harsh on Greninja, especially if he goes for that offstage. It has to be a guaranteed hard read, and I respect it from that at the last second because... Sharp was obviously going to go for a boost kick, but that cost him so much. All right. So, I mean, after all that time sitting around, we saw Sharp come out like a bat out of hell, ready to just bring it to Ned, and Ned was not ready for that. If this isn't a motivated Sharp,